Hi there, I'm Angela Oberer, and today's good idea comes from Nicole, who's been smoking over a pack a day for 15 years. Nicole, it is awesome that you have decided you want to quit smoking. That is awesome. Okay, smoking is you against your self-discipline. It is you against your own habit. You are the only one that can make yourself stop smoking. So the fact that you've decided to do this totally rocks. The number one reason people don't stop smoking is they're afraid they're gonna get fat. And they're replacing the smoking with eating food and other habits. They're replacing a bad habit with another bad habit. So what you have to realize is smoking in and of itself is a physical addiction and a psychological habit. So as you replace the physical addiction, which is the nicotine, you will find yourself in a better position to deal with the psychological aspects. So the nicotine, first of all, um, you can either go cold turkey, totally cut it out, or you can wean yourself off of it in half. You smoke a pack a day, tomorrow you smoke a half a pack, the following day you smoke a fourth of a pack, all the way down until it's one puff of nicotine and now you've weaned yourself off of that. The psychological habit of smoking is people smoke with, with a cup of coffee, with their friends, with their business buddies or whatever. And you have to disassociate yourself from that situation. I now hang out with my friends and I don't smoke. I now have my cup of coffee and I don't smoke. I now do my internet stuff and I don't smoke. And you break yourself away from the smoking part of it. Okay, so stop smoking. S-T-O-P. S stands for see yourself as a non-smoker. T, tell all your friends you now no longer smoke. They will help you to not smoke. O, oxygenate. When you're smoking, you just took in a deep breath and then you held it and you exhaled it. That is so important to good living. You still have to breathe in and breathe out. Too much of the time we don't get good oxygenation through our bodies. So oxygenate your body and your brain. And then P stands for physical activity. If you are smoking a pack a day, that is a lot of smoking breaks, right? So instead of standing there smoking, do something with physical activity. Go run around the block. On your next smoking break, go run up and down a flight of stairs. Your next smoking break, do 15 push-ups. The next smoking break, do 15 lunges, 15 squats. Replace that with some kind of physical activity. And if you're doing the oxygenation and you're doing the physical activity, you won't gain the extra weight that you would have been gaining if you replaced that by eating snacks and eating food. So you wanna quit smoking? I know you can do it. Lots of people quit every single year. Not only is that a good idea, that is a great, idea. And Nicole, I know you can do it. It's a good idea. A lot like these dance moves. It's a good idea.